sleepless dream, walking through a jungle of silent and numb trees. Their leaves were falling on the floor, curling, brown, and crackling. As I walked, I could feel the forest spirits watching me. I did not call them forth, so they did not come. I walked until my feet and back ached. I walked until I reached the edge of the jungle. I awoke to a life of running away, away from lies, away from truth, away from a fate decided long before I was born. Escaping was the only way I knew how to stay alive. I was a good runner. I ran all the way to the edge of the world and threw myself into the void. Suspended in non-reality, I lost who I was. My umbilical cord to this earth had been cut, and I was stranded, alone and afraid, tortured by the cold, the dark, and the grief of the death of a certain self. I carried all the weight of my mistakes and swam back to land. It was on the shores of my consciousness that I met Long Mu. She raised me as one of her own, as she did my father, my grandmother, and all the dragons in my family. With all her kindness and her strength, she taught me to go within 